Hi, I am Dr. Rashek Reddy. I am consultant neurosurgeon in Continental Hospital. Today I am going to explain about the brain tumors, how they are going to present to us. Most of the patients who diagnosed with the brain tumors will present to us with headaches of long duration, with any associated feature like vomiting, seizures, or any weakness of the limbs or speech disturbances. Normally, they will present like that. A patient having a long history of these symptoms should be evaluated with an MRI. In MRI, we try to look out for the reasons for these symptoms. Very rarely, in 1 in 100 cases, we see brain tumors with this history. Brain tumors, once they are diagnosed, it creates a lot of stress on the patients and patient's family. But if you approach the patients with the scientific evidence and it's very easy to deal with them. If you identify the brain tumors in at early stages, it's very easy to deal and find a proper solution and cure for the patients. Once we diagnose with the brain tumors, what we generally do is to confirm the diagnosis with appropriate investigations like MRI brain and spectroscopy. With these investigations, we normally confirm the diagnosis. But the gold standard of confirming the diagnosis is by doing a biopsy. How we do biopsy is we have to open the cranium by doing a craniotomy. Craniotomy means creating an opening in the skull of the patient. Then we open the dura and expose the part of the brain, only limited part of the brain. Then we try to take out as much of the tumor as possible. Sometimes we can do only biopsy also. With the help of modern technology like neuro navigation and preparatory MRIs, we can locate the tumor with precision of 2-3 millimeters and we can cut open that part of the brain only to gain access to remove the tumors. Depending upon the histology of the tumors, we try to remove the tumors completely. And if it is located in the eloquent areas, we will be more careful with the help of this modern neuro navigation technology. We can remove the brain tumors without harming the adjacent brain tissue. Once we remove the brain tumors, then we subject it to the biopsy. The biopsy is going to confirm at what stage of the disease it is there and from what kind of tumor it is coming from. So after knowing the biopsy report, then we can know whether it is a cancerous tumor or non-cancerous. If the cancerous tumor is there, then we have to subject the patient for radiation and chemotherapy. Continental Hospital is having excellent radiotherapy and chemotherapy departments. Thank you.